Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 44 of Let's Play Your Old Peanut for Stars for Third Odyssey for Vinland, where we are currently invading uh, to take over some Prussian land and to get the Austrians out of this war. Um, I believe the goal was to stop them being friends with Russia. And that was about it. I mean, we could also go for the you know, whole break, you know, break up Bavaria thing, but uh, we will see. I don't really decide. I don't think we've. Uh, Really landed on where we were going to do what we were going to do that way wise, but uh, we shall see. We shall see. I mean, we've only got really 35 years because I am not going past the end day with this one. Because honestly, that's just it's a lot of effort that it's just it's it's not going to really not really that rewarding, you know. This is where I get that. Okay, I was about to say this is where I get that for before you know we can do there. Now, with the amount of people we've got, it shouldn't be too, like, the, 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 you know, the growth and the, uh, you know, the uh, killing and the uh, being awesome shouldn't be too bad against um, Austria. Like, we should, it should be a pretty easy uh, stomp. Uh, sure, benevolence. So I'm 142 percent. It's going down at a whole fucking punk hecton of a 4.8 right there. That's a uh, that's a pretty fast uh, rate right there. I do say to myself. All right, let's just speed these along. We've not even got to the uh, actual sieges up here yet. I mean, we'll get there. Don't you know, don't get me wrong, but uh, it's gonna take some time. What the fuck do I even? Wait, where the fuck is the rest of my? All right, it's still over in here. I thought they'd already merged up. That's my bad. At this point, this is a slow but sure growth. Ah, oh, fuck. I, I thought the Austrians were about to uh, kick my guys' asses there, but nah, we fucked them. Okay, uh, basically everyone else is doing my sieging for me at this point. I mean, the bad thing is, like, piecewise, that's, you know, what we want. But, like, we do need that from Austria. The, the problem is, it would piss off everyone. Before I forget, let's clear that off and make, make sure at the very least they're getting, you know, I don't want them to, you know, be able to peace out just yet, so. You know what? I feel like just pulling my men back and, you know, letting uh, everyone else deal with this. I mean, that's, a, like, that's an option. I want to see if I can dislodge some of these uh, Armin armies. Because honestly, I don't want them where they are. one of those situations where that army is in fucking danger. Just like that army right there is. How dare you walk into my territory? How dare you do such a good job of killing my men? How many men did I lose there? Not more than them, luckily, but uh, I believe the term is a whole fucking heck ton. Okay, we... I don't think we actually dislodged them, but, you know, Siege still got fucking done, so still a win. Yeah, 
think the real issue is, obviously, you know, manpower and all that. And the fact that our manpower is just draining away. I mean, realistically, if we could just get Austria to st stop being friends with Russia and Savoy. And you got no Prussian land. All right. There we go. Give you that. That's the wrong flag, Joe. Now we could go with that. It makes these guys a little stronger. Those idiots are allied to Austria. So we just put Austria straight back in the war. We'd have to add in the Lunaburg Clause. Because the whole point of giving them that extra province is so we can take it. But obviously if they're allied to Lunaburg, that kind of beats the fucking point. I mean, it should be an easy fix, really, so... See? Easy fix. Uh, what province... What provinces do you have claims on, my friend? Uh, can I get you Dramburg too? Uh, oh, I don't have claims on that one. For some fucking reason. Uh, let's get them Staggard as well. Uh, it's Neum I mean... Neumark's all well and good, but uh, it's not a problem you can fucking take, so... Yeah, so that's a little bit again, a little bit more. We're adding there, uh, we're adding to the effort, but in the long run, the effort really is going to be worth it. I think about it, it's a bunch of extra shit for us. It's going to take a little bit of time, but uh, we've got the French, we've got the uh, Ottomans, we you know we got we got we got the, we got we got some mad lads on our side right here. Shit sieged and just get shit going, you know? Fuck yeah, Danzig's done. Let's move over to uh, Queensburg. I'm pretty sure. I, I, well, I'm not pretty sure. I know I'm saying that wrong, but it's okay. Okay, this is 39% uh, with a 60 piece. I mean. I believe the term is fuck up the forts, and uh, that's uh, unfortunately what uh, we're going to have to do in it. Alright, the Palatine, let's just get you out of the war, because, you know, people are wasting their time sieging you up, and that's just, that's not useful. Oh, fucking damn it. Stop sieging me up up there, you little shits. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna... I'm just gonna finish that off. Because then I could do this. Where is it? Oh. Just look at this. 169%. 5.3 a year. Basically just big boner energy right there. I don't even know how much like I'm I need a lot of that fucking Corian fucking um <laughs> tech, but honestly, ten out of ten would fucking do that again.
just so perfect. Alright, that's that one done. Let's get Salzburg. I mean, the Austrians have got troops. So I don't know what the fuck they're doing. Apart from apparently dicking about like a fucking dumbass. We're going to uh, just chill here for a little bit. Oh, stop, you poor, poor fucking bastard. Wait, my claims just got removed off those two. Well, I'm still fucking taking them. Sorry, uh, sorry, Stol uh, Stan, you, uh, you, you kind of got fucked in this one. I won't lie. You, 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 you got fucked. Ah, oh, damn. You're cheap. We'll just end both the wars. Call the cheapest. For everything else. And look at that. We have a nice little claim on Northern A on there. People over here are getting pissed off at me, but we're losing 4.4 and we're coring, so, you know. We, uh, we have ascended, essentially. And now, because of the coring, we're going to be, uh, you know, we're, sorry, because of the uh, converting, we're now going to be, you know, making sure, you know, we've now got a little bit of time going on the uh, whole... Not needing to worry about, you know, coring stuff, so. A win is a win is a win. Yeah, I'm pretty happy about my whole North Sea Empire. I feel like my capital should be moved the way this shit's going. Maybe you can go home. I mean, we're spending quite a lot of you every day. It's some pretty hard conversions, but we got this. If only I can make Hess my vassal. Technically, I could. It, it would it would be a decent sized war. Like me quite a bit. When you look at it from this perspective, that's a bunch of cores that they could get. I, I feel like it's uh, my duty to. Um, 
kind of uh, send my allies after them. Of course, not to do it myself, but, you know, of course, send my allies after them, vassalize them, and then, you know, slowly convert them to my own faith. God, France is just so fucking powerful. So is Ottomans at this point, so. Yeah, we're looking pretty on that one. 62 months in Konigsberg, let me guess. It's a, yeah, it's a decent sized fucking province. There's the 38 months. Let's uh, fire you, fire you, fire you. Well, I got the guy wide, so it's fine. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah, shit. We also got an idea here. Uh, both of those are fucking useless. Cool. I mean, we could add a military one. We've got a few military ones to choose from. Land attrition, definitely. The Preparation Act, definitely top tier. Um, I'm losing money, but I'm really not fussed to buy it. We're losing it due to corruption. Hey, Lunaberg, you want out? You, you, you kind of look like you're a bit fucked in another war there, friend. You you have no army. You, uh, you don't really have anything to do. You sure you don't want out? Um, I don't know if uh, staying in the war is uh, going to be any good for you there, friend. Are you an elector? No. Revolutionary Frankfurt and Revolutionary Austria have the exact same fucking flag. Oh, beautiful Danzig's already Norse. That's perfect. Oh, shit. Mecklenburg's in this war? If I was trying to piss off everyone, I would annex them. Annexing, uh, vassalizing Hess feels like it's already going to be a little bit too much. Well, I got a, I got a nice fast guy there. And there actually fucking was a revolution. I knew I should have waited to click that button. Why the fuck is Alicia... They're doing a sip... Oh my fucking god, they're invading. Alicia is in the home world. Alright, that's interesting. Didn't expect to see those assholes over here. You know what? I might just go balls to the wall and just ex just take shit at this point. The game is going to be over soon, so. It may as well, eh? The best part is I had to do a sweet fuck all. There are any peasants, so I don't really have to care. Yeah, sure, whatever, I don't really care. You did the smart thing of giving me land. 
Yeah, as much as I would like that, I'm gonna need to unfortunately do that. Yes, I'm aware that you don't like me. Um, I heard you had debt, and I can just pay you off, so it's completely fine. Chris, expansion-wise, is looking um, pretty spicy, pretty spicy, but... Uh, yeah, Sydney Austria is going to be a real issue, and we've already beat them once, so I mean... What are we going to do? Beat them again? Of course we are. Um... Beautiful. So now we're just a couple of provinces away from uh, having the full borders. But unfortunately, guys, we're actually going to have to end this part here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, check out all of the links. They are linked down below. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys then.